Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video and in this video we will be restoring M3 steering wheel from E90. Basically it's me from the future, I just forgot to film the intro so I'm doing it now. I have the steering wheel ready and it ended up pretty nice. So if you want to see how you can restore your own steering wheel in a pretty cheap way, um, thinking about something like $20 mostly, $20-$25, just follow along and you'll see how to do it. Now that we removed the old gum coating uh, from the steering wheel trim, it's time to paint it in a new color. Uh, I think I will use gloss black and also I have a couple other such steering wheels that I'm working on so I'll get those done in the same time and let's just do that. Quick one second jump to the future. Obviously for you it was a second, for me it was somewhere around two months. I didn't have time to work on this and now I just got back to it. So what happened is that I sold my previous steering wheel, only the surrounding, like this bit, uh, because it was in actually good shape and I bought this in a really bad shape. So it would be, basically it would make more sense to restore it. And obviously I have this painted from previous time and I have the kit to apply. Also later, once we have the kit applied, then we will install the red button to here, since this kit has a red marker on the top, and that should match pretty nicely. So let's get into the stitching, and let's finally make the steering wheel look good. So as I mentioned in previous videos, the most important part is to apply the cover perfectly, and we will start by doing that. Side that has these bits goes to, the, to up. And to place it perfectly, you need to cover both sides up and try to match at the original stitching, like this. Now that I have this, the lever cover pretty much applied, as you can see, it bends over nicely. Time to take the two double sided adhesive and place it all around the stairwell from the inner side. And I'll just do that now. So I have double sided adhesive tape applied from both sides. This is pretty much how you should do it. Put two layers at the corners here, here, and there. And from here, we just need to stitch it up. I won't show you the process. I will just show you the final results. Uh, since I already did a video on how to apply such style lever replacement cover, I will leave the link up here. And if you want to see that, just check that video out and then come back. For this one, I will use dark blue. Since it has the cyan, red, and dark blue should look nice in between. The steering wheel is finished and before I put everything together I went to change this button and to remove it I had to use the screwdriver to peel around the corners and it popped up. So I have a new one in red to match the marker color and this one is from AliExpress for $4. This just pops out and this goes in the top left corner. Ta-da! Once we have installed the new button, we can put everything back together and put it on the steering wheel to get a final result view.
this basically concludes the video, steering wheel is complete and I really like how it ended up looking at the end. So if you need any links, let me know in the comments below, but basically all the parts that I used uh, came in from AliExpress. Steering wheel cover was around $15, while the button was around $5, including shipping from China. So yeah, you can do the same mod for your car and thank you for watching this video. See you guys in the next ones.